this. First of all, welcome to Thursday. Uh, you'll notice today I'm wearing my Air Force shirt. Now, typically on Thursdays, we wear T-shirts that have to do with colleges and universities to kind of give students an idea for what they can do after high school. But as you know, um, my son, one of my sons are in the Air Force, but the Air Force actually has the world's largest community college. So you can join the Air Force, or a person could, maybe not you, but a person could join the Air Force, learn a career, get paid for it, go to college for free. Not a bad deal. So anyways, I'm wearing my Air Force t-shirt in support. Now, uh, you may have already heard something about the assigned seating arrangement. You will notice here, if you look at the paper, you guys see that okay? Okay, uh, this is the, uh, um, the seat numbers in my classroom. And so hopefully by now you've had a chance to see which seat you'll be seated at. Now, when you come into the classroom, find your seat, pull up a chair, and simply sit down. You'll notice up on the screen or up on the board some sort of learning target, success criteria, and an agenda for the day. So you have a little bit of an idea simply by looking at the board. Occasionally there will be some assignments that we'll need to get started on right away, either on the front supply table or the back supply table. Invariably, at some point, somebody might have to use the bathroom or get a drink or something along that line. When you're using the bathroom, it's very important that we sign out and then sign back in. So, watch carefully, please. Right over here, just under the American flag, there's the sign out form. I've got it on a clipboard here, and there's several sheets here. Uh, you will simply sign out, uh, indicating that you are leaving. Your name, the hour, today's date, where you're going bathroom, drink, counselor, whatever. And then the time you leave, the sign out. And then when you come back, please remember to sign back in. It's very important that we have both of those. Other times you may uh, need to move around the room and get some supplies. So as we look this way, as I mentioned, back here on the back supply table, you'll find our whiteboards, markers, blank sheets of paper, different things like that. Uh, these are supplies that if you're working in a group, one person should come back here and get those supplies. Maybe another person gets something else and just kind of divide and conquer. So everybody's kind of doing uh, different things. When you are done with an assignment that needs to get turned in, you remember right over here, we have the basket. Okay, the turn it in basket. This is where you'll put your paperwork. Please do not put your paperwork on my desk, on my rocket cart. That's a dangerous place. Stuff gets lost there, okay? I have way too many other resources up there uh, for things to be going uh, up on that table. So please don't put things up there. So um, when work does need to get turned back to students, after I've had a chance to record it, I will typically put it right here in the correct box for whichever hour it is. Sometimes if you miss a day, if you're absent, I will take the papers that you missed and just put them right in there. Make sure your name is on it and slide it in there so you can find it. If you're gone several days in a row, you can pretty much be certain that you've got papers in that box that need to get picked up. So hopefully that kind of gives us a little bit of an idea on what some of the routines and the procedures are in the classroom. And um, good start for the great year. I'll see you guys later.